G'day folks, I'm Cleggy with Aussie Detectorist and just well within the last 24 hours or so XP have dropped the Go Terrain app for the XP Deus, the XP Deus 1 and the ORX. So in this video I'm going to show you how easy it is to get your XP Deus or your XP Metal Detector set up with your Go Terrain app. Radio, let's head over and get it done. Righto, the Go Terrain app. Let's get it all set up on our Deus 2s. Um, also works with the Deus and the ORX as well. So very similar system. So you're going to need your phone, no matter how battered, your Deus 2 and obviously your coil. Now if you've got more than one coil, get them all in range. So if you've got the 11 inch to 13 by 11, whatever coils you've got, get them in range. Because as I found out, the app doesn't pair to the remote to the coil and I'll show you that in just a second so let's get it all set up step one grab your phone <clears throat> head over to the uh, in my case this is I'm on Android if you're on Apple go to the Apple Store I'm here at the Google Play Store um, I typed in go terrain at the top XP Deus and the go terrain Explorer 31 comes up there and it's already installed on my phone so just hit install uh, and it'll install it on your phone. Rightio, I'll head over to the app. <coughs> so this is the app already installed on the phone and as you'll see up here uh, <coughs> oh, uh, this is the app already installed on the phone <coughs> so as you'll see the Deus is already connected. So how do we get it all connected? So number one make sure that your app is open. So go through the process to register uh, and all that sort of thing. So have your app open then we simply turn on our Deus remote control. Now we don't need audio for this so I'm just putting it on the wireless headphones. Uh, so there we go. Then go option into settings and go down until you see the go terrain here and using the plus or minus set it on auto so you can set it as a push notification or just let it set up automatic um, so I've chosen to set oh sorry I've chosen to set it up automatic so that's all we need to do there as far as the remote goes so then you can leave that over there open your app and in the top right hand corner uh, it'll be red if you're not hooked up click that and it'll go through a scan process and what will happen is it will pick up on your coil serial number you can see that there so that's why I said to have all your coils in range so you compare them because remember with an XP Deus the metal detector is inside the coil so unlike well, any other metal detector I know of, there isn't one, where the metal detector is actually in the coil. So it's not pairing with the remote, it's pairing with the coil itself. Alright, so make sure you pair all your coils. Then you can go through here. Now this is a really cool mode that I didn't know existed. Um, <coughs> if you want to uh, automatically <coughs> select a target and save it, um, you can open up a push notification to do it as well. Swipe three times in five seconds on targets to save them. So you can change that around. Might be four times or three times or whatever. But set this away from your normal swing speed. All right. Otherwise you're going to be sa saving a lot of targets. Uh, so what I would do is set this three times in five seconds. That's probably a lot slower than what I would swing. It's a real lot slower so when you're checking a target and you're bam two three four five you might do five or six swings in a second or two uh, so when you set it like that once you if you want to save a target slow it down one two three I'd probably even lower that to three seconds so th three one two three uh, and should automatically save your target for you but getting it set up is just as simple as simple as so if you need to what you do is you hit the search Deus R here we might as well just repair mine <coughs> I 
the speed of Bluetooth. And there it is there, so there's the coil serial number pops up. And all you do is go over to here, activate it, and then all your settings come up here, and you're ready to go with that coil. So if you've got more coils, make sure you pair the lot. So once we're done, what's interesting is when you get a target, oh, better go back to the detect screen, I guess. There we go. TID number comes up in the screen up here 57 so I'm just waving it over the coil and whatever metals in the table so oh so the TID number comes up in the screen there all right it gives us a map of where we are <coughs> click back on bring the details back up gives us a map of where we are uh, and all that sort of stuff so pretty cool I'm going to play around with more of these features now but that's how you get it hooked up it's just a very very simple process of hooking it up and away you go so hook your app up I'm looking forward this weekend weather permitting to digging in and having a go uh, and getting out amongst it because some of the settings in here where you can track uh, your hunt there's even a setting in the app here where you can set it up so that you can actually no need to look at it anymore. Um, you can set the app up so that when you're hunting in an area, you can actually set a border up. And if you go outside that border, your phone will vibrate, so it knows you're that. So you know you're outside your set search area. So that's just one of the features I've noticed in the app. So with the remote, um, that's all you need to do. Once it's all paired up, just put it on that auto mode. I found was the easiest way to go. Um, it's a two second job to get it all paired, I've made it look all complicated and hard because I'm making a video, but get the app, it's a two week free trial, it's $9.99 if you're in the States or if you're in Europe, uh, $14.99 a year if you're in Australia, it's a yearly subscription service, um, and I think this app is going to become my go to detecting app, I haven't had a detecting only app before, we've always had to use apps like Trilobite and things like that, uh, and this for me, the go terrain app, even if you don't own an XP, uh, the tracking features, the ability to be able to, to uh, target finds and take photos of finds and record their locations. If you're a gold hunter or something like that, um, over time this will create an amazing picture of where you've been finding gold in areas and it might open up new areas close by that you may have overlooked. So as a mapping uh, system alone, I think the GoTerrain app's worth its $14.99 a year. All right, head over to your either your Google uh, your Google Play Store or your Apple Store, download the app, get it set up on your detector, and I'll be back with another video shortly, and we'll show you some of the in-depth features, and we'll, we'll use some of the mapping and stuff like that, get into the fun stuff. Rightio, thanks very much. This has been a video for Aussie Detectorist. I'm Cleggy. Enjoy detecting, and enjoy the GoTerrain app. You're going to love it. Cheers. Bye-bye.